NASCAR Racing 2003 here at Darlington. Very fun track. Qualified 27th after not doing very good. 74 laps. It's about 20%, I think. And we're going to see how good we can do here. It's a very, very tough track. Love this game, though. Really enjoy racing it. Um, it's very difficult with this tire model to catch spins or getting loose. Like, you have to get on it early if you have any hope of catching it. Might need a pit stop. Cautions are on. Full field. Let's see what we can do. It's going to be trying to take it easy for a little bit. And this is how I race it. I got no overlays on. Let's go ahead and grab fourth gear. Hopefully we can go green for a little bit. I imagine we will be able to, unless I wreck myself. I'm going to be checking out very early. Try and get the inside before Dale Jarrett behind me sneaks up there. So yeah, very... Just got really interested in running some good offline racing. Uh, after watching Nick's F1 videos, Casey Atwood, running the Splash and Go graphics, uh, 2003 mod, which has a better damage model and a few more uh, paint schemes for people. They'll dare almost snuck in there. Okay, they're they're checking up big time into turn one. Now I'm going to lose this spot. I'm just backing off. Though I really can't because of all the people. Almost catch the wall. Alright. Settle in here. Really good racing, though. This game provides some fantastic AI racing. Um, I'd love to do... Whoa, that was scary. I'd love to do a, a full championship season, 2003 season. I've got some cool ideas for that, but I don't know if anyone's going to be interested in watching that. So we're going to see how this video does, I guess. It's not, none of that's going to, this isn't going to replace any of the iRacing stuff. I'm still doing as much of that as I can. It's just a little bit easier to record this because I can do it any time. And I don't have to worry about a session being populated enough to get an actual race in. So yeah, we're just here having some fun. Got loose on entry there. I had to catch it pretty big. And if I do need to step away for a minute, this game allows you to pause. So that's nice. Brian Vickers. Not gonna have a very good entry or exit. Alright. See if we can catch up with these guys. Should be able to. Um, I'm just in general very bad at qualifying. So the 27th. I didn't even use qualifying set because the qualifying sets in this game are ridiculously difficult to drive. Big, big run here. Nowhere to go with it, though. Just kind of guard that inside. If we can. Jump to the inside here. Follow Sterling Marlin. around Michael Waltrip as well. Dale Jarrett's moved up there. We're pushing tight there in the center of one and two. Maybe something to keep in mind as the tires get worn. Feels a little bit different than iRacing, I'll tell you that. 
But uh, it's fun. Oh, it's struggling to turn now. No in-car adjustments for weight jack or something. Brake bias. At least I don't think there is. They might be brake bias now that I think about it. Real tape. Pretty sure there's no brake bias. It's a uh, track bar and wedge, which you can't change until you pit. Could use a track bar adjustment though, I think. We'll see if I can last the entire race without wrecking myself. I do have trouble because their braking points can sometimes surprise you and I end up braking a lot later than them and bumping into the back of them and that just spins you no matter what. I have no assists on, of course. See, just like that. <laughs> they just check up for no reason. But that wasn't too bad. I think we're okay. A little bump. losing time to the leaders though. I think this two wide up here with Kenny Wallace and um, Ricky Rudd I believe is what's slowing everybody down. We are in 25th on lap 13. Keep an eye on that throughout the race. Hopefully the audio is okay. I've tweaked it a bunch. I'm gonna get a good run here, but I don't really want to take it three wide. We got Michael Waltrip coming. I'm gonna just guard the inside. If I can. And Dale Jarrett gets a good run on the top side there. Keep it a little bit lower. Get another good run here. Well, not that great. We'll look to the inside. Outside. Okay, he cut us Still some there. slack there. Clear. Just managed to clear him off the corner as I get pretty loose. Having the Mayfield. He's very slow. Clear. They do wreck by themselves, but it is uh, not often, as was the case back in this time for NASCAR. You'd have really good racing, not wreck fests like crazy, like can sometimes happen in today's cars because they're so close to each other and there's no way to get away from anyone. But this is what NASCAR racing is about. This is the golden era. Early 2000s. Very powerful cars. Very narrow. Not really that uh, much downforce. Like you get behind somebody and they'll get loose because you're taking the air off their spoiler. That does not happen anymore. As the front ends of today's cars are so sealed to the ground with the splitter. And in general teams are better at dialing all that in. Man, it is not turning in 1 and 2 anymore. In general, getting very tight. Hopefully, we can keep the car underneath us. And 
don't clip the wall because you will stick to it like glue. You thought eye racing wall glue was bad. Not this. This is something else. Alright. See if we can track down Robbie Gordon. See if the tires can make it 74 laps. I think we can on fuel. Mm, it's going to be close. <laughs> It is going to be close. Look at this little group of cars here. And a big gap to the next guy. Oh, I locked up the front. Oh no. The yellow flag is out. Let's go. Race back to the line. Pit road is closed. Nobody hit me. Nobody hit me. Please nobody hit me. You have to race back to the finish line. Yeah, I locked up the um to the end of the pacing line. I'm gonna take a splash of fuel. I walked up, locked up the left front, and uh, that got me way loose. I tried to catch it, but somehow nobody hit me. Just a little bounce off the wall. So we'll go down pit road. What do the tires look like now? Left front. We're going to get four tires, a little bit of fuel. And hopefully, we'll be okay. I didn't want to do a green flags pit stop here anyway. I forgot to practice that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down. Looks like everybody's going to be pitting. What position are we in now? Oh, 41st. That's not good. Pit road is now open. It's all right. Keep it under 45. Keep it under 3,500 in second. 3,500 in second gear. See if I can find my pit box. Remember, don't pass the stop sign at the end of it's pit right road. It's right there. The pace cars in turn one. Very tricky pit road in this game. The pace cars in turn two. Go, go, go! Limit 45. Keep it under 3,500 in second. All right. Came out okay. The pace cars on the back straight. Watch that speed now. Keep it on 3,500 in second. Okay, you're clear of pit lane. Stay behind the 43 car. All right. What lap was that wreck? It was uh, like lap 22 or something. We're definitely good on fuel now. Oh, I forgot to make a track bar, doesn't it? But getting loose. Okay, merge when you can. The track bar would just make it worse. Always a mess coming off pit road. Really big mess right now. Jeez, three wide. <laughs> also, we do have We're going green next time by alternate views. Five. Unlike iRacing. And you can see my very old car that I don't really care for much anymore. <laughs> I like the sponsors, but uh, I don't. I don't really like the color scheme. 
or the number design still having some trouble figuring out what to do up there too wide it is single file restarts and we are still in 41st that'll happen when you self spin it's gonna take me a little bit to get back to used to racing in this game Looks like they're going to be uh, too wide to come to the green. Um, they did do that sometimes in real life when they were disputing like positions, but I'm, this is just yeah, them right not Go being able to figure out what line they're supposed to be running. Cars in. It's just pushed into the outside line. We're going to be starting mid corner when we come to the green. They get much better restarts than me. Should be faster than most of these guys back here, though. Trying to be taking it easy here, though. And get back to where we were. Just run the bottom. Should get a good run here. Not really good enough, but I'll take a look. Track narrows up so much, I had to get on the apron there, and I still did not get the pass done. Now we're going to be really clogged up here, though. Two wide in, one and two. I think he got into the wall there trying to avoid me. I, I didn't get that close to him, though. Sounded like he scraped the wall. The 79 here, I'm not sure who that is. Let's see if he makes more passes. Dive it up to the inside, clip the apron. They get the run on the top side though. A little bit of room. Don't need much. Clear. And they checked up big time and I got into his left rear, but we're okay. Thought for sure I was wrecking there. <laughs> Oops. Ooh. Yeah, I'm kind of too low in the middle of three and four. Ooh, I had to get out of it there. Are we three wide? I don't think so. Can I make this pass? Woo! Barely. Barely make the pass. Alright, get another good run. Can't get it done though. I think we'll be to his inside into turn one. 
All right, backs out of it. Almost made it back up to where we are, I think. Nope. We were up to 25th or something. We're a long ways away from that. Only started 27th, though. that time. Car just so tight. All right, should get another good run. Might be able to get around Kyle Petty as he jumps to the inside and kind of blocks me. He's blocking me and the zero. Should jump out of it, give us turn one. There we go. See if we can catch these guys up here. Might be tough, but we will try. Have pulled away from guys behind us the flag. We're halfway, halfway. oh car is not turning at all so tight break as straight as I can Too low here. I have to jump out of the throttle if I don't want to hit the wall. Still almost hit the wall. We have caught up to these guys though. Might be able to get to the inside before turn one. Probably not a smart thing to do. Dave Blaney. Too wide. Had to go to the inside. Clear. Really getting held up here by the 46. Okay. Ah. Pull away from me in that corner. Definitely better in one and two than I am three and four. We got Dale Jarrett up there stuck on the outside. Get a good run here. I'm gonna jump to the inside, or at least attempt it. Keep low. Clear outside. Okay, I got the clear. Outside. Get underneath Blaney. Gonna get stuck by Atwood. Clear outside. Outside. 
but he's going to jump out of it, being on the top side to turn one. All right. Settle in here. We're going to have 30 to go. Steve Park up there on the outside now. Whoa! Very good run. That was close. He got very tight, I think, and had to jump out of it. Ooh. I feel like I'm going to overdrive entry and hit him again. I'm going to get a much better exit off, so I, I am overdriving slightly, I think. I'm going to get another good run. I'm just better off the corner than the AI is right now in turn two. They're better off in turn four. Ooh, I had to jump out of it there. Make a little contact with the L1. Should get the position. That was scary. Car's not turning. Almost get the wall. Okay. Kenny Wallace. Going backwards. Take advantage. Not going to need a very good run, though. Entered too low. And they're just pulling away out of four. Inside. And Kenny Wallace jumps up the inside. Almost get to the inside of Park. Might be able to scare him up here. Looks like we can. get the position. We might have made it back up almost to where we were. Not going to have time probably to get the top 20 though. Jeff Green, I'm going to get a good run on him. And take the position. Into turn three. He's going to battle back on the outside though. Oh, car's pushing like crazy. No! Oh. Hold the brake. You all right? The yellow flag is out. Let's go. Race back to the line. We got big time problems with that motor, buddy. And that's just how easy it happens. Oh, we got that freaking tire catch issue. That happens. I have a good camera view. See, sometimes when you get close, the tires will like jump together and cause that puff of smoke, which causes the car to just get crazy, and I had no chance to save it. Luckily no one else hit me.
And holding the brake in this game is not very effective. Like, it just slides like crazy. Unless you're the AI. <laughs> but oh well. I guess that will do it. Um, it was fun, anyway. L would love to do a full season. This track is just so hard. But would love to do a full season. I got some cool ideas for that. Um, I've never done a full 36 race season before. I've only gotten to like 25 or 26 races. But yeah, let me know your thoughts on that. If that is interesting at all. Otherwise, this will be it.